Right, question number four. A ball of mass M is moving with constant velocity in a horizontal circular path of radius R. So the ball is attached to a string of length 24 cm and makes a conical pendulum as shown here. Okay, so what is it asking? We have to, find, uh, we have to sketch a free body diagram and then if theta is equal to 30 degree, calculate the radius and velocity. Plus 2, if the angle is more than 30 degree, what can you deduce about the velocity of the ball? Okay, <clears throat> so let's firstly draw the free body diagram. So this is a horizontal unity axis. Okay, so this is number four. What do information do we have? Um, we have the japa. Uh, we have the. Okay, so we only have the length of the string, which is twenty four centimeter. Um, a ball with mass m. Itu jani. Okay. So now we have to sketch the free body diagram. So this is our. Let's draw the forces. Mg. You shouldn't have any problem drawing free body diagram, sudah by now. Okay, so that is basically just the forces that is being experienced by the pendulum. So this is Mg. This is the tension. The angle is here, no? Here. Is angle is here. So this is theta. Okay. So that is the free body diagram. The plus two, we have to calculate the radius as well as the velocity. Okay. So the radius can uh, can be. Theta B Roman 1 So theta is 30 degree Dia bagi kita theta to be 30 degree Lepas tu dia ada bagi kita Length of the string which is 24 cm which is equal to 0.24 meter Okay so the radius Is just L sin theta Trigonometry okay yang ini Shouldn't have any problem So this is 20 this is 0.24 sine 30 degree so the radius is uh, 0.12 sorry sorry meter 0.12 meter okay so that is the radius the past we have to find the velocity velocity at theta equal to 30 degree okay so now this one um the mass is not given, but that will be cancelled later. Okay, so let's just do it. Resolve it into x and y component dulu lah. So total force at x, since the acceleration, the centripetal acceleration is moving towards the center of the circle. This is AC. Okay, so there's velocity there. So this is MAC. So the total force at x is just the tension. So tension sine 30 degree. Okay, so tension sine 30 degree. T sine theta mv square over r. Okay. Okay, lepas tu, this is our first equation. Lepas tu, we have to look at the vertical component which is equal to 0 lah. Yama to be okay. So total force at y is equal to zero, which is just t cos theta minus mg equal to zero. Okay, this one uh, t cos theta spread up this in minus then mg here. Okay, all right. Um, so this is just t cos theta theta equal to mg pastu 
t is just mg over cos theta. This is equation 2. So just substitute 2 into 1. So mg over cos theta. This is sine theta equal to mv square over r. Okay. Plus 2, the mass can be cancelled. Plus 2, sine over cos is tangent. Eh? So, g tangent theta equal to v square over r. So, the v is just r g tangent theta square root. Lah. r g tangent theta. Okay. So, the velocity is equal to 0.824 meter per second. Right? So that is how you solve question number 4.